My name is Brianna Marie Trice. I am 22 years old. Unfortunately, my father passed when I was four, and um, I've been participating in Camp Sheila since the second camp. I was truly like a daddy's girl. I loved everything about my daddy. No one could ever tell me that he took a peppermint. <laughs> like, there is nothing you can tell me that my daddy did wrong. As a father, he loved his kids. He um, was so happy every time I was pregnant with a child that he didn't know what to do. The circumstances around my father's death was he was at a, a birthday party for one of his cousins. And um, prior to the birthday party, she had had an altercation with a young lady in the neighborhood. The uh, Another altercation ensued and my father was sort of trying to kind of break everything up, trying to be the peacemaker in the situation. Once he decided to leave, he ended up um, going back to grab his coat. And when he came back out, um, a few people who had heard about the altercation happening came back to the party and shot him. I was only 25 when he passed, so it was just like a shock for him not to have been there uh, just the next day. So it, it had a big impact on my life. I remember uh, one certain one point in time just feeling like uh, super sad. Uh, one thing that I always had anytime I felt sad was either my mama or my daddy. My mama was being taken care of by other people at the time, and she was having to lean on shoulders. With her having to uh, be consoled, I just really felt like I wanted my dad. And that was something that I don't think I would ever forget, just that feeling of wanting my daddy and not having him there. Camp Sheila is a three-day camp that um, is put on for children who have experienced some type of homicide or act of violence against someone in their life. Camp Sheila was like almost a savior to myself and my children. They definitely um, brought Rihanna out of her shell quite a bit. When I first came to Camp Sheila, I was struggling a lot with suicidal thoughts, um, a lot of depression. It was seeing Kevin first share his story um, at camp on day one that he does every single camp. And that really um, impacted the way that I, I saw my grief journey. And just to understand that it is a journey was something that was so new for me. Camp Sheila let me know that there are other children and other people who have gone through the same thing that I went through and that what I was feeling wasn't wrong. Coping with the loss is not ignoring it. It's really paying attention to it, becoming one with it, and really understanding why you feel the way you do. I've seen her at her low points. It, it was crushing. So for her to come, you know, out of a lot of things that she came out of, and now to be such a, a very productive, um, just vibrant young lady, it's seeing a flower blossom like right before your eyes. One of the things that I, tr I learned from going to Camp Sheila was that nothing was impossible. I ended up double majoring in sociology and criminal justice with a double minor in philosophy and political science. I, when I go to the camp, I see all these little kids and I, I see all of my peers and I think like, well, that's a, a future senator. That's a future firefighter. That's a, that's a, a future teacher. These are our future leaders, and if we aren't giving back to organizations that are helping our future leaders and helping the people that are going to be inhabiting our space, then what are we doing? I've decided to go either in civil rights law or criminal law because I want to help other people who have gone through similar experiences like myself. Because one thing that Camp Sheila did for me is that it gave me a chance, and I want to be able to give other people a chance. I would like to thank you guys so much. Um, you just don't know what impact you've had in my children's life. It's been an amazing ride with you guys, and um, I appreciate everything that, that you've done for myself and the children. I want to thank the Doyle family specifically for taking a tragedy that could have defined you and making it something so much bigger and so much more positive. And I want to absolutely thank all of the donors and everyone that will be contributing to this event. When you're given to Camp Sheila, you're given to children, and you're given to parents, and you're given to families that need that help. I never knew the value in my story until I came to Camp Sheila.